Hello, and welcome back to Pokemon Diamond. We're off to fight these guys now, basically. Come on, top. Oh, yeah. Clucky Crunt sent out Cascoon. <coughs> and I sent out Casker. Casker, bite that monkey. By monkey, I mean that onion shaped weird bug thing. Oh, yeah. Oh, darn it. High defense, of course. And he's even, he's getting even higher. But I'm gonna go and risk it. I'm gonna tackle him. Because I think I can take him down still with a taco. Boom! Take that, Cascoon. Oh, sweet. Level 19! Alright. Player defeated Galactic Grunt. You messed up my job, now I'm gonna... Not gonna get a bonus. See, if you're more passionate about your job, man, you would do better. I hear they're going to do something with electricity, I think. That's not even Todd Top songs. I'm just doing a bad guy voice. Alright, next victim. Let's do this. You were challenged by Galactic Run again. Go, Wurmple. I forgot to read the dialogue before, but it's okay. Go, Kasker. Bite that Wurmple. Bite it. Bite it. Bite it, Lee. Bite it. One of my favorite quotes from Rush Hour. Not sure if it's Rush Hour 1 or 2 or 3. One of those. Uh, Galactic Run sends a Glam Meow. Yes. Come back, Kasker. I sent out... Manny Pacquiao, what? Boom. Manny Pacquiao. Glam meow. Um, low kick that monkey. Oh shoot, he just slapped my ears. That glam meow just slapped my ears. Oh, I flunge. Low kick him again. Oh jeez. I hate fast, fast cats. Oh, a Manny Pacquiao would! Woohoo! Player defeat Galactic Grunt. I really don't like kids who happen to be tough trainers! Got 400. Pokemon. -y. You don't have an inkling of what Team Galactic has to achieve. Of course, they don't have a Grunt like me, anything either, but still. Ugh. Oh. Oh. I'm one of the team collab. We've been trying to create a new world that's better than this one. But people are showing little understanding about what we do. You don't understand either, do you? It's a little saddening. So let's have a battle decide what we should do next. If I win, you leave. If I, you win, we team Galactic will leave. <clears throat> Alright, let's do this, redhead man. Commander Mars. I believe that's a woman. She's a smoker. She's a, she's a smoker. That's why she sounds like that. Oh, jeez, Louise. I can't tell by little sprites what the gender is. They're sprites. Well, not in this case. They all have a colored hair. <clears throat> Boom. You're dead. Because Spark is super effective against flying. I do my research. <laughs> Alongside of college, I do my Pokemon research. Oh, this is terrible. <laughs> Purgly. Come back, Kasker. Manny Pacquiao's gonna go back out this time. Because, right? What's this Pokemon Pergolo? This cat thing. It's just like the evolved version of the last thing. Pergoly. Pergoly. What does it say? Ew, it's disgusting. Seismic toss that monkey. It looks like a rock. He can do it. Okay. Once again, Manny's not the quickest. Ooh. Oh, that sucked. What do you think you're doing to my Pokemon? <sighs> oh, the cigarette. Oh, what just happened? Oh. 
For some reason, I forgot the animation of Karate Chop, so I thought the Perglu was doing something to me already. Oh, jeez, Louise. Yeah, beat him. Nice. Man, he grew level 20. Player defeated Commander Mars. The can't be a loss. You, you uppity brat. <sighs> oh, I'm so mad I'm gonna smoke a pack of cigarettes. Oops, I messed that one up. That's all right. Tough. I quite I enjoy the battle. Oh, my throat is hurting from the. I'll leave you for the time being. Team Galactic. He looks like this. They were saying they had to gather Pokemon energy no matter what. It was for creating a new universe, or so they claimed. Nothing they said made any sort of sense to me. I can't tell you how grateful I am for saving me. I can finally see my little daughter again. Papa! Yuck, Papa, you're stinky. Go shower now, stinky. Oh, sorry. Haha. <laughs> they had me working nonstop. Thank you, trainer. You made these bad people go in. I think the balloon Pokemon will come visiting soon again. Emma said scene. Oh yes, a balloon Pokemon appears in front of the Windworks. It's always a certain day of the week, but I'm not sure which day. Could it have... Oh, sorry. Oh, shoot, I missed it, because I was trying to think of something. Hmm. Thank you, trainer. You made it. I think the balloon Pokemon will go visiting. Okay, nothing interesting. Well, time for me to do some research, and after a quick save, see what day the balloon Pokemon is coming in, and just to see what it is, period. Welcome back, and since last time, I went to Google what the Pokemon was. Not only that, but I caught him. So yeah, you guys get to see what it is in a bit, because I forgot the name. I renamed it. Him, her. Ghost-type flying Pokemon that looks like a balloon. Drifloon. Drifloon? Drift... I don't know. You slather sweet honey on a sweet-smelling tree. Pokemon may be attracted by that crap. Okay. Good to know, man. Alright, let me check something real fast, because my FPS is weird. Well, I'm back from checking my FPS, believe it or not. Whoa, the transition is perfect when you're using an emulator. Oop, ignore that. If you guys saw that mouse clicking thing. The cursor. Alright, let's continue our journey, yo. Let's not break the story now, when you see all these external things, like me stopping to check FPS and the cursor and whatnot, because that could ruin things. That could ruin the image. You're challenged by Camper Jacob. He says a Ponita. Oh. 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 I sent out Unjin, and she's gonna mock punch the crap out of the Ponita. Mock punch! <laughs> and that's how Ponita sounds when it goes down. That sounds terrible. <laughs> Do oh, heavens. Don't. Okay, ignore I said that. I joke about, like, making horse noises. Oh, man. <laughs> They say they're rare Pokemon in a turn of forest. I better be more prepared than this. I I didn't even try to make a voice that time. Oh, good heavens. If you slap a sweet honey on the I talked to this guy already. <clears throat> well my throat really hurts from doing that smoker voice. Oh, good heavens. Oh, what is this thing? Shellows. Looks kinda lame. Looks kinda scary actually. <laughs> it's like that it's a pink blob thing. Mock Punch, Unjin. You can do it. I think it's a water type, right? Which is kinda dumb. I'm fighting water type with my fire type, but it's okay. Unjin's pretty hard. Oh, crap. Mod Slap. That's also effective against fire if I'm correct. Super effective. Oh, man. <clears throat> Unjin's accuracy fell. Sorry for the cough. Unjin use. Oh, crap. I missed my Mock Punch. And he mad slaps me again. Just scratch him. You have nothing to do with Jin, just scratch him. Uh, I shouldn't have mock punched him in. I should have just scratched him. <clears throat> I didn't think scratch would be working. Okay. <clears throat> Excuse me. Whoop whoop! Level 20. Count it up. Um, should I switch places with Kasker? I mean, 
They're all level 20. It's not really a point, I guess. Maybe, I don't know. I was a rock person. Those rock guys always have, like, rock Pokemon. What are these hikers? Is that what they're called? Or, like, cave dwellers people? I don't know what they're called. Yeah, sweet, Fawn X Attack. Things like X Attack, I never use in Pokemon. I don't know why. I just never use them. There's no mountain here! Oh, he's a mountain guy. Not a mountain guy, what was his name? You're challenged by Hiker Daniel. Oh, it's Hiker. Daniel! Sends out Geo, dude. Okay, I can't make any voice that streams my. It really hurts. Mock punch him. He's rock type. We're fighting slash fire. We got this. We have the technology. We can do this, Unjin. It's super effective. Alright, next one. I'm like that heartless trainer. Alright, next one. I will fight every single Pokemon in here with my bare fist. Apparently that's my own impersonation. Well, of course, same punch. Come on. It's a rock type. When he does something different, I'll do something different. How about that? He sends out, like, a ridiculous Pokemon that's hardcore. I don't even know what's a hardcore Pokemon. He sends out a Lugia. Or, yeah, Lugia, is that how I say it? I feel like I'm saying it wrong. Whatever. He tries to switch it up. He's like, I'll send out Machop. Nope, I'll send out and up. And he's gonna gust your Machop. Hmm. How's that delicious Gus? It was thoroughly enjoyable. That's my chops voice. A Bidoof. Well, I'll send Unjin back out. And he'll just mock punch that Bidoof. Done and done. I should use this time to say that I'm going to try to finish Pokemon Diamond. And uh, then I want to play Pokemon Black or Pokemon White. I just like Pokemon. I'm going to continue the Pokemon going. But I'm kind of not, I don't want to say bored of this one. I guess I'm so far behind that all I do is catch up editing, and I don't like that. So, yeah. I want to play Pokemon White and play it properly. Not like this, where I have to go back and edit it. Because I have like a lot, a lot of things. A lot of Pokemon to catch up with, and I did it poorly. My Pokemon uploads really well, so I might as well get take advantage of it. So yeah, that's my little update thing on Pokemon, and I might play Pokemon White. <clears throat> Probably will. And more other games that are low resolution for the time being until my internet gets fixed. So let's do this, Aroma Lady Elizabeth, who sends out a Badoo. I send out, um, Unjin. Can't remember my Pokemon's name. Yes, why did I name my Pokemon so exotic? I can't remember it. Flamber. Yes. I almost said Flame Wheel, but that's like too excessive. <clears throat> it's super effective. You're darn tootin' it is. No one says that. You're darn tootin'. Not even people in like Texas say that. Because I assume people in Texas say things like that. Is darn tootin' like Southern? Like, well, howdy y'all. You darn tootin' is right. If you plant lots of berries, you can be surrounded by berries and trees and oh my, Barry Obama. <clears throat> I don't, I don't mess with Boozios, Boozios. He's a water type. I'm just gonna run away. Flee, Unjin. You can't take him on. Good job, Unjin. Oh man, there's a smorgasbord of trainers here. Come on, look at me. Look at me. Oh dang it. Look at me. There you go. <laughs> really, <laughs> they didn't look at me. I had to talk to him first, but still, it's okay. You're challenged by Picnicker Sienna? Or is it Selena? I think Sienna. That's a nice name. Anyways, flame wheel that little Shinx man. Or woman. Girl. Unjin. Good job. Why 
What kind of Pokemon trainer would I be? I like versatility. I like having a group of different talent. Much like... The Mystery Men. I don't know. That was a stupid reference. Um, what, what reference should I use? I want, like, the... Like, the Justice League. How about that? Or the Avengers. I want different talents in my group. But, like... Hmm. I guess we can watch Pokemon in the anime. I haven't watched Pokemon lately at all. Oh, sweet. 21. Like, they are pretty nice, actually. Even, like, the bad trainers are nice to the Pokemon. Except Gary. He's a dick to his Pokemon. What can I tell you about Pokemon? Well, there are males and females. And some that you can't tell. <laughs> okay. What Pokemon can you not tell the gender? I think it's... Unknown, right? How can you tell what a gender of Andup is? Or a Drifloon? I mean... It's a balloon. And there's a ghost. Oh, found a Pokeball. I think my favorite part about Pokemon is... <laughs> It's catching them all. I like to catch them all. <clears throat> and that sounds silly, considering you don't haven't seen me catch any Pokemon. But I like catching Pokemon. Oh, that sounds so ridiculously stupid and cliche. I mean, like, people like battling and stuff. I don't know. If I could catch all the Pokemon, I would. But I need self-control, otherwise it'd be ridiculous. Just me catching, like, random Pokemon all the time. I think it's satisfying trying to, like, capture a Pokemon, I guess. After like battling it down to its like little HP, and then get by. Uh, it's nice. I'm gonna throw a Pokeball at this Geo dude that's already taken now because I'm talking about capturing Pokemon. But I need a solid team, so I'm not gonna do that. <clears throat> the foe's Geo dude fainted. Cassie gained 219 EXP points. Player defeated Camper Zachary. Hua! I'm out of Pokemon that can go. Should think twice, Zachary. With my Pokemon by my side, I'm sure camping will be a poop trainer tips. I'm not even reading this. I'm just like, what's the trainer's best friend? What was the trainer's best friend? I didn't read it properly. Oh, another hiker. Let's do this hiker. You guys are boring me now. Of all places possible. Oh, I didn't read fast enough again. Onyx. It's like the rock version of an Ekans. Ekans is like. Oh. Well, this is kind of like. <laughs> mismatches in it, but whatever. Casca can do it. Atkins is like the snake version of a Girodos, a Gyrodos, Girodos. Delicious lamb stuff, Gyros. Mmm. Bite. Holy cow, man. How long have we been playing Pokemon? I feel like I did nothing but just like ramble on weird stuff and talk about food. Having lost his way, the trainer lost the battle too. What? The trainer? You? What? He like spoke to about himself in like third person. From being lost in the mountains so long, I became a hiker. Oh, look at this person. Come on. Oh. Let's get this person. Repel. I like to like go past people who are walking too. I feel like I have skills. Like, oh, boom. Whoa. Showdown. I'll sue. I'm not trying to hold back. Well, me neither, girl. Let's do this. That could have been a uh, horrible and you on up. You are challenged by Battle Girl Kelsey. Kelsey sends out a Machop. Let's do this, Kels. Go, Kasker. Kind of mismatch, huh? Um, probably spark or bite. Doom, son. Level 15. Get off my jock, son. Art, art, art. Get that weak stuff out of here. This is a ghetto, man. Just kidding. I don't even know what I'm saying anymore. Yeah, you got 244 winning. 
You taught me how- Oh, shoot, I didn't read it fast enough because I heard a noise. I mean, I could go back, but I don't feel like it. Oh, I don't know. Should I play a little? I got the time, girl. Let's do this. You're challenged by Picnicker Karina. Let's do this, Karina. She sends out Piplup. That was probably the worst thing you can send out. The worst. Might as well send out Magikarp. What will Kalskir do? Kasker is going to destroy this little cute thingy. A Piplup. Piplup! Before Piplup fainted, Casper gained 190 EXP points. He also grew to level 21. Fantastic. Yeah. Player defeated Picnic or Karina. Oh, boo. How insulting. I got 224 Pokemon money. Listen very closely. You can hear the cries of po What? That's like the saddest thing ever. Listen closely. Can you hear a Pokemon die as you watch helplessly? Might as well just say that. That's very creepy. You seem to be tired, Russell. Well. Oh, yes, please. Well, I think that's in this episode, guys. Been playing for a while, so thank you for watching. And tune in next time. I'm gonna sleep in the bed. <sighs> What's up, Sam?